Yo guys, welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another thrift haul. Um, I'm coming at you with something a little bit different. I did film a haul with me actually in it, but the audio decided to be absolutely terrible because I forgot to plug in my mic. So rather than ruining you guys' ears by listening to that terrible audio, I thought I would just do a quick run through of all the stuff that I picked up. So without further ado, let's just get into the haul. So the first thing I picked up is this navy blue Nike windbreaker. I picked up quite a few windbreakers which you guys will see later on but this is just one of the first ones that I picked up. I really like the retro old school vibe to it um, and I really like the contrasting colours so of course I had to pick this up and I just paired it with my high waisted Levi's and a cute cropped up. Then the next windbreaker I picked up is this really cool grey windbreaker. Um, and I really liked it as well. I really like the cool grey and the hues of blue through the top and Yeah, I thought it was just another cool windbreaker to pick up as well um, And I picked it up picked up around the same time. I picked up the first one. So that was really cool I think someone just gave away a whole load of windbreakers. So of course I had to pick this one up then I picked up this baby blue feeler windbreaker um, and I really just like the colours. It's very different for a windbreaker. I haven't seen one in this colour before. Um, definitely old school retro vibes as well. And yeah, I just paired it with these pink joggers just to add to the contrast. Then the last windbreaker I picked up again is another feeler little number and it is just white grey and black and yeah nothing to really say about this one standard has a hood on the back which is different from the other ones as some of the other ones don't have hoods but yeah I just really like the colours and feeler is definitely my favourite brand to thrift then the next thing I picked up again from the men's section is this really cool oversized um, yellow and black muscle tee. I really like it. It just has a pair of boxing gloves at the front and it's a really just nice piece to lounge around in the house in and I just like the colours so of course I had to pick this up. Then I picked up this really nice vintage Armani denim jacket. It's just in a dark wash and I really just fell in love with the colour and the oversizedness of it. <laughs> if there's even a word I can't remember. But yeah, I just really like the cut of it and it's a really like nice slouchy feel to it and it definitely gives me retro old school vibes. So I had to pick this up. Then I picked up a few hoodies. The first one is this navy blue and white Adidas hoodie. Um, I think this is an old school one, but I thought I'd pick it up. The arms are a little short on me, so I probably will sell it on my Depop. But yeah, I really like it. And the last hoodie I picked up is this old school Reebok navy hoodie. Um, again, I got this in the men's section, but it's come up a little bit small, so I don't know if this shrunk. But I probably will sell this on my Depop, but, but it's a really nice um feel and it's comfy and cozy and just something to just throw on whenever you just can't be bothered to wear anything you know then i picked up um this really nice kind of fuzzy teddy bear baby blue um cropped jacket um and i think this is originally from miss selfridge i'm not quite sure but i just really like the softness of it and it's a really like cute winter jacket for this autumn then what is my thrift haul without a pair of mum jeans? I found these vintage um, high-waisted blue wash denim mum jeans by the brand Principles, I think it says. Um, um, I'm not very familiar with the brand, but um, they do fit pretty well, um, but they're a little bit big on my waist. So I would definitely be selling these on my Depop. So if you're from like a 28 waist um, upwards, these will look absolutely awesome on you. They're a really nice fit and they're practically brand new. Then I picked up this really cool red and black Puma kind of sweatshirt top. Um, this came up absolutely tiny on me. I wasn't aware that it was actually a kid size. I thought it was just a size small so I thought I could squeeze into it. But the arms are absolutely too tight and too short so this definitely will be going up on my Depop. But I absolutely love the colours and the back is absolutely wicked. Then I just picked up this oversized men's adidas um t-shirt i guess you can call it it's definitely bringing out my inner tomboy vibes 
um, I just really like this I wish this was a bit longer because I definitely would wear this as a t-shirt dress but it's a little too short so I probably would just throw this on with my Adidas leggings but I absolutely love it and it looks brand new and yeah can't really go wrong with a little Adidas mumbo then the last clothing item I picked up is probably my favourite find out of the whole haul and it is this vintage oversized colourful ski jacket and I absolutely love it. The colour is absolutely gorgeous. I love the hues of purples and blues and orange. I just think the colours just work so well together and I absolutely love this and this is actually new with tags. The tag actually says 1995 on it. This is how old this jacket is but it's in really good condition. I don't think it was ever worn but of course I had to pick this up and this probably might be on my Depop. I'm not sure but um, have a look out if you guys really are interested. Then going on to shoes, I picked up a few shoes and the first pair are these hot pink um, old school Reebok trainers in this kind of like suede material. Um, I haven't seen a pair like this before, um, maybe I just haven't been on the lookout for them but um, I really like the white contrast against the pink and they're in pretty good condition so I probably will sell these on my Depop since they're a little small for me as they are a UK 5.5. Then I picked up these vintage cream slash beige mules. Um, these are very, very different for me. I still undecided whether mules suit me or not, but I do usually like the look of them, but I just never know if they suit my feet or not. But I thought I'd give it a go with these ones as they're quite a neutral color and you kind of compare these with anything. But uh, yeah, I'll see how these go. <laughs> Then I picked up a few boots, um, the first ones are these kind of beige, um, kind of tan brown colour, um, I really like them, they're definitely screaming kind of Bratz 2000s vibes, so of course I had to pick these up. I have a similar pair but in a kind of a lighter colour, but I really like this colour and um, they're really cute and great for this autumn, so they probably will be up on my Depop. Then I picked up another pair of boots similar to the first ones with the square toe but these are slightly different, um, I'm not quite sure if I actually like these, I feel like they look cute in the charity shop but once I got them home I was a bit like mm, do I actually like these, um, I really like the front but I'm just really undecided on the back of the heel, I feel like it's a very weird shape maybe just for my foot shape I don't know. Maybe I'm just looking at them really strange, but I kind of do like them. But maybe I will sell these on my Depop because I feel like someone else will love these a bit more than I do. Then the last pair of boots I got are these really cute um, burnt orange little booties that I decided to squeeze my feet into just for showing purposes. These do not fit me at all guys but they're definitely serving um, Rihanna Fenty Puma vibes from her latest university collection which really inspired me to do a um, thrifted inspired lookbook inspired by her collection so look out for that video but yeah I thought I'd just show you guys because they're absolutely cute and I had to pick them up. So uh, that is the end of my haul guys, I really hope you enjoyed, if you did please do give it a thumbs up, don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below if you haven't already to see more videos from me and go follow the Depop shop Retro Eclectic if you guys want to check out all this cool stuff and I'll see you guys in the next one, peace.